We welcome you to the grand finale at the Mayor Radha Krishnan Stadium. Indian hearts beating for them will look to quell a spirited Malaysia in the final. Climax that you would expect on what looks like a momentous final. Two teams who are willing to put their hearts out. Malaysia in the yellow and black and India storming ahead in all blue as they have done so very often. India have been starting well of course but it is Malaysia with the first up circle entry. Abu Kalas right. Who's minute. He beat German Preet there rather easily. Got the with us is on the first battery. It goes to Jugraj. Jugraj it is. Opens the scoring. That is a crack like not forget. He's just got, he's made the difference here. Harman Preet is not on the impact that he always wished. Well, I wish we had a speed gun to measure this. But struck furiously. And went with the angle. Almost covered that. Did Othman. But that was too good and too quick. And this is another excellent quality of this Indian side. If Harman Preet doesn't get you, Jugraj will. A uh, very fine job with Malaysia. Now, the men in yellow are on the attack, but once again, it's Amit Rohidas who's doing a great job, but Malaysia has found the equalizer, made the circle entry, and in the blink of an eye, that has proved over and over again. Abu Kamal, it's the goal for Malaysia. We have singled him out uh, as being really dangerous. Faisal Sari goes down, was looking for a penalty corner, does not get it to continue. They play to the whistle. That is the most important thing. And full credit to Azwan Hassan. Kept going, kept going. Abu Kamal Azrai has done so well to control that ball and then fit this play as well. At the end of it, he was almost within handshaking distance of the Indian captain. Ready for the injection once again. It's not a good injection. He needs to get this out. They have finally done so. Malaysians are rushing back in defense. Hardik on the baseline. That is the final and last action of uh, an engaging, engrossing voting. And it will also please you as a neutral as well. Some high quality hockey action at the end of the first quarter. India and Malaysia are one of those. And bigger, wider tyres for every terrain. Push back then in uh, the second quarter. Shijesh is in goal for India. It's not the best injection. Malaysia will go again. It's a penalty corner. The best thing is uh, to work another penalty corner and go again. Razi Rahim goes for the goal. I think that's got a deflection. It's gone fast and right at the roof. It was Razi Rahim, the senior pro. It looked like it did catch a deflection off Amit Rohidas. Yes, it has. Off Amit stick. Right on top right. There's very little that Sri Jesh could have done there. It was travelling and Malaysia have rallied and now Sprung Harmanpreet has done that. Excellent from Manpreet once again. Looking to make that circle entry a foul. A clear foul there. Almost uh, a loose pass. Mandeep has an open chance. Goes for goal. It's not on target. It was a full-blooded backhand by Mandeep on target. This was the earlier chance. Karthi Selvam. Try the backhand and then Vivek gave this everything. He really did. There's nothing more he could have done. Hafizuddin Othman's uh, positioning was absolutely brilliant. Spot on. Malaysia. Najmi Jaslan's rack flick is wide. It is uh, that rack flick. And it's a man from the central battery. And he scores again. Malaysia. Gain. So the goal stands, and it is Mohammad Aminuddin, the man on the first battery, who manages to make that incisive goal. Make much of it, or can they? They make a circle entry, a backhander, not struck with conviction from Manfred, and that will be the last piece of action in the first half. And India. I've certainly been left rattled by some Malaysian brilliance out there. 
Malaysia have played while there was a 1-1 result in the first quarter. Malaysia have gone on to pump in two more goals and lead 3-1 at the end of the first half. But features like corner bending lights for dark and tricky turns, segment first features like fastest acceleration, and bigger wider tyres for every terrain, which is what India need on this terrain as they kick off. Does routine not work on one occasion for India? It's a perfect injection. Harman Preet Singh has gone wide. He says it's got a foot, but Malaysia are sure. Are they sure? in the second Hardik, the injection is good Jubraj goes for it it's gone wide again they are looking for that left angle Selvam goes for goal it's a good save it is a good save it's a confident save by Hafizuddin Othman he's put out his right uh, leg padded that away there was that move Kazi Selvam shifts the ball Razi Rahim was very careful there to the Indians they have so many players in defense uh, only a long con slap by German. It was a good spot by German. Good forward vision by him. And this trap or this mistrap by Akashdeep took it uh, towards uh, Fizuddin Ozmi Jazlan for Malaysia on the first battery. Goes to Najmi Jazlan. Goes for it. Amit Rohidas. That's a great line. Now India need to get this away. They have numbers in attack. They have Jugraj. They have Hardik. Look at the overload that India has achieved. Akashdeep shifts it. It's a penalty corner. He's played advantage and it's a tackle. There's no penalty corner there. That was the penalty corner. Namit Rohidas at his best. Got the stick in front of his legs. Made no error there. Hardik did well to shift that ball back to Akash. Akash looked as if uh, there was uh, defense to offense. And Malaysia once again on the run. Dispossessed. And Neil Kantashama. Making that circle entry, an opportunity just off target. But that's a penalty stroke because he's been brought down at striking distance. But it was Neil Kanta who set things up and Sukhjit was on the stroke. A lifeline for India. Look to eliminate the defender himself, look for the pass and then this is brilliant. Looks for the nutmeg, he's got down, that's a penalty stroke. There's no doubt of India with a minute to go in the third quarter, he's for this. They are one goal behind only. And what an impetus. And what a great good numbers up front. And Harman Preet does what he does so very well, so well, so very often. Top. 40 seconds only remaining. They are all over Malaysia at the moment. Balls come in. Here's a chance. It's a goal. It's the equaliser for India. It's good chance. Singh. He's done it. It's 3 all, and Malaysia have been defending too deep for too long and they are paying the price. What a turnaround this has been and look at the crowd. India have managed to stir up a remarkable recovery. That's Gurjan just punting the ball in much to the relief of the men in blue. Sukhjit playing it into Karthi who played it back to Gurjan. Excellent team goal from India. Arun, the important thing here is that uh, Gujan did not take any half measures. Forward pass, but they've lost possession. Arman hits that in because there are less than 10 seconds to go, understandably so. Things up front on the penalty stroke for the captain. And at the end of an exciting, thrilling third quarter, India have come back. It's three all. Now they're all up on their feet. This is the final quarter. Everything to play for. And Mandeep begins things now. Quarter four, India on the upswing, but Malaysia have been dangerous through the match. It's three all and everything. It's Faisal who takes it. Instead of looking for the vertical pass, Faisal Sari went for the flick. Something good. Wins the ball for India. Makes that forward pass. Circle entry time. Another great ball. An opportunity for India. But somehow Malaysia cleared the line. Oh, it's a perfect injection. Harman Preet Singh goes for it. What a save that is by Hafizuddin Othman. He side immediately to beat a defender. That was uh, Harman Preet. Hafizuddin Othman trusted his first two rushes. It's Harman Preet once again. Yeah, he's on the first battery. Needs to be perfect. He switched batteries, but it's not on target. I think that was very smart, but uh, he 
split the wave as well. Uh, Harmanpreet, you could see that Marhan Jalil did not come at him. It was a single rusher at him. And once he did that, yeah, Craig Fulton knows it should have. Press forward and make the mistake. And no mistakes there. Playing the forward pass. India looking for the circle entry. They gain the circle entry. Oh, what a swap! What a shot! And out of nowhere, out of Steve Singh rises to the occasion. Like a phoenix, he's been hanging it up and down run. But come at the arm, come at the man. Akash Singh soars to the skies and so do India as they notch up their fourth goal. I think it's to Azwan Hassan. But uh, what a move this is again, counter attack by India. You have to give credit first to Shamshir for winning that ball in midfield. He nicked the ball off Azwan Hassan. And that is why he's got the yellow card. Because Sean Rappapo has gone back to that incident. And he has given him a yellow card for the tackle from behind. Then let's talk about the brilliance of this man, Akash Deep Singh. We've said he's not been having the best game. In Malaysia right at the time when the clock is ticking. India, can they take advantage? Once again, with the fact that Malaysia have one man pure, Hardik. Give and go. A reverse. Backhander. Zad. Less than 10 seconds on the clock. India making another forward run. India are headed to a famous win. The clock's ticking. The crowd knows it. The players know it. The final. Who turns up? Captain of India, Harman Preet Singh, taking the trophy from the Honorable Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu, Sri M.K. Stalin. I request the Indian team to kindly come.